fresh. Oh, thanks. It's a little something I wrote back in the 70s. Nice. So, uh, what is that actually that you're playing on? Oh, this old thing, so say? It's my flying B ukulele. I was curious. Say you're just using the open strings. How many different chords could you create? I'm assuming that you mean any time I strum two, three, or four strings at once. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, um, there are four possible strings to choose from, actually, so to say, and each has two positions, plucking or not plucking. So initially, I'd say two to the fourth. However... However, um, I need to make sure that I'm not including the possibility of plucking either no strings or plucking just one of the four strings. Thus, my final answer will be two to the fourth minus one minus four, which is 16 minus one minus four, which equals 11. 11? If I did the math correctly, yeah. I think you did. I think you did. Okay. So let's step it up a little bit. All right, Are you ready? Let's do it. I'm ready. Let's you say ready? you were going to use the... Uh, the open fret, but also the first, second, and third frets. Okay. okay. Then, how many different chord possibilities would you have? Okay. Okay. Well, this time, each string has five positions, namely not plucking, plucking the open string, or plucking one of the first three frets. And we still need to subtract the combination of no strings and also each possibility of plucking just one string, which in this case is 16 total positions. So each of the four strings has uh, four possible positions. Am I making myself clear? Oh, clear, crystal clear. Okay, okay. Yeah, so the solution ends up being five to the fourth minus one minus 16, which is 625 minus one minus 16, which equals 608. Oh, wow. You know, that's kind of a lot considering that you're just using a few strings. <sighs> I know you're going to ask me for a pattern right now. You so know me so well. I do. So listen, if the chord spans n total frets, including the uh, open string as a fret, if that makes sense, then there are n plus 1 to the 4th minus 1 minus 4 times n different chord possibilities. What's up, Sosei? Well, I just came up with this fiendishly difficult problem involving chords on a ukulele, okay. but uh, it has a very lengthy solution, so I think I'm going to save it for the viewers at home. Say, it's a little early in the series to be breaking the fourth wall. You have a point there. I gotcha. Ow. Ow. Math pros, math pros, it's the end of the show. We are letting you go till the next episode. Try to crack the code, keep solving the play. Loosen up, do a couple math problems a day.